Joining me now, David Bonson, managing partner, Bonson Group, and author of There's No Free Lunch. David, welcome back, as always. Um, so, leading indicator, index of leading indicators keeps falling, and the purchasing managers came out, the S&P purchasing managers, uh, that keeps falling, and is there a recession in our future? Yeah, so you have the leading indicators, manufacturing, ISM, industrial production. These things are real important. They're headed down. You also have labor looking very good. Wages have hung in there. Um, so there is conflicting data. And I've been talking for a while now about the possibility that we end up with a recession, but it feels like that 2002 recession that Bush Jr. had, where no one really even knew we had one. It was after dot-com blew up, and, you know, we just had a huge breakout with the uh, crypto and tech companies and things like that. That's where all the layoffs are. There's big the tech. tech companies. They're all big tech I companies. Know. Fascinating. That could end up being the extent of this recession. Mm. So not so bad overall. But I, I think hard that goods, though, manufacturing. industrial production and manufacturing yeah. don't look good. Can we just go to this tech thing? We don't have enough time to do it justice. The Justice Department, the Biden Justice Department attacking Google, uh, Lina Khan over at the Federal Trade Commission attacking Google, um, hauling them off in the court, maybe threatening to break them up. So, look, I'm not going to defend everything Google said. I don't get your take real quick. Just let me say this. I'm not going to defend everything Google ever does. But... I just worry that we are attacking our best technology companies, okay? Let's destroy them, and that leaves this field to China's tech companies, which are second and third rate. Why are we going to eat our own children? This is the thing people never think about. When they went after a lot of our Wall Street firms, they didn't realize, you know, there are big financial institutions in Europe, Asia, yes. other places that will gladly step in in that capital markets role. The thing with Google is funny is most people doing the research on it have to go to Google to do some research, right? <laughs> uh, it's a pretty important right. part of right. our, our life. The DOJ deal, this was the Clinton administration in the 90s, mm. went after Microsoft. They tanked the stock for about three years. It was down, I think, 40%. And then when all was said and done, they got nothing out of it. Mm. Um, antitrust should be a difficult thing to prove. Mm -hmm. And, you know, there's talk about Amazon having antitrust issues. It's like 5% of retail sales. It's a bigger percentage of e-commerce, but total retail. That, I don't believe that's monopolistic. Where's the, right, where's the consumer harm? Where is the consumer harm? Nobody can argue that Amazon harms the consumer. And they do some terrific stuff, Google. I mean, I guess we're running out of time. But, but they should be going after Google on privacy issues, oh, yes. not antitrust. Yes. Yes. Trust. yes, that's exactly right. And we should change Section 230 and yeah. all that. That stuff for sure. But I don't want to favor Chinese technology companies. That's what this will do. Unintended consequences. David Bonson, smartest guy west of the Mississippi, no question about it. <laughs>